Hi, I'm Kina. I'm an electrician. I met Jess when she joined us as an apprentice uh, about three years ago and uh, she got the awesome news about being pregnant. Uh, we were pretty excited for her. Um, but unfortunately, uh, as soon as she got pregnant, um, she suffered severe illness. Um, and being a sparky and having to be on your feet and being alert and being aware, she couldn't come to work. Uh, she used up all the sick leave. Um, maternity leave didn't kick in until six weeks prior to her giving birth. So she had a rather large gap going to low pay to no pay, so she had to rely on to her partner to cover her, um, all her bills, um, obviously all the hospital visits, all the medical bills. I, I was, yeah, very concerned for her. Um, you know, new baby on the way, and not having an income, it's just, it's just a concerning matter. We have income protection as part of our EBA, and when Jess approached, uh, she was told that she wasn't covered under the Protect Insurance because it required an overnight stay in hospital. Uh, even though Jess had gone to hospital several times for day visits to get her, her uh, hydration up, um, unfortunately she wasn't covered. So, so I went to the uh, ETU WA State um, Delegates Conference. Uh, we had a, um, the income protection representative um, step up in front of us and explain you know the benefits of the income protection. I took that as an opportunity to um, confront him. Uh, John was very very concerned. Uh, he over the three-day conference he gave me his business card three times and yeah that we put this email we put it forward to um, the representative and they welcomed it with open arms. Um, they gave Jess a ex gratia payment for good faith. So Jess was covered, which was good. And then they put in the right steps to change their policy so that all women who are pregnant and do get pregnancy related illnesses will be covered under the new insurance plan. Um, without Jess, we wouldn't have been aware of the fact that this hole in the, the income protection. It's just great to see that she's back on her feet, she can pay her bills, pay, pay her credit card. She's loving um, her time off with her boy. Um, I think she just started today at TAFE. Jess is a pretty inspirational um, girl ever since all of this happened. She's been up front um, voicing her her troubles and her wins and she's been a great um, role model to all females in male dominated industries.